Hi there everyone, welcome to my channel and in this tutorial video we will create average student grades using for loop and arrays in C++. Before we start, I would like to say thank you so much to all of my viewers, supporters, subscribers in my channel. Thank you for watching my videos, commenting, and most importantly by subscribing. Before we start, I would like to say thank you very much also to my friend Tom who helped me out no, in my learning journey in C++ programming. Thank you, Tom, for uh, supporting me, no? especially my channel. Tom is a good friend of mine that is also a software engineer. Okay, so before we start, if you like this video, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share and please support me channel, guys, by clicking the subscribe button. So let's get started. So we have here three library files, sharp include IO stream for input output sharp include numeric and array header file in c++ const expression int num grades 5 int string array int num grades grades so we have here the title average grades using four loop arrays in c++ and then we are here looping statement and then we are asking the user to give five grades after which there is a built-in function accumulate that is belong to our numeric header file auto sum underscore grades accumulate grades begin and end and then auto avg grade sum underscore grades num grades and then we display the average grades here and then we have here end of the program i'm using code blocks in writing this program Big, and I will put a link in the video description guys so that you can download the complete source code for free okay so the next step that we will do is to run our program build and run okay so average student grades using for loop and arrays in C++ in, inter student grade number 87 we have 76 95 85 83 so the average student grades is 85 and a program out of 5 grades. So another example, inter grade number 1, 95, inter grade number 2, 83, inter grade number 3, 86, and grade number 4, let's say we have 75, grade number 5, 99. So the average student grades is 87% and a program. So the grade number one is 95, grade, num grade number two of the student is 83, uh, grade number three is 86, grade number four is 75, grade number five is 99. So the total average grade no, of the student is 87% end of program. So this is the end of our tutorial video on average student grades using for loop in arrays in C++ using modern C++ approach. Thank you very much guys for watching. Kung gusto nyo ang video na ito guys, no, sa mga kapwa ko pong Pilipino, pakilike lang po, share. If you find my videos useful in your learning, please like, share. And most importantly, if you are new with my channel, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video tutorial guys. This is your friend Jake saying, Bye-bye for now.